Have you ever had anyone give up on you? Perhaps it was an algebra teacher who didn't think you were going to get algebra 2. I was probably one of those. Maybe it's a spouse who didn't think you'd ever get a job or a better job or maybe lose the weight that you'd been talking about. Could be an employer who was frustrated or is frustrated because of your seeming failure to understand new computer software and programs. But let me tell you something. Give up? Never. Here are five reasons why you should never give up. First, God puts you on this journey to success, so never give up. 1 Corinthians chapter 1, verse 7 in the Message Bible. God who got you started in this spiritual adventure shares with us the life of His Son and our Master, Jesus. He will never give up on you. Never forget that. Second, God will give you a new way of doing things His way. 2 Corinthians chapter 4, verse 1 in the New Living Translation. Therefore, since God in His mercy has given us a new way, never give up. And number three, regardless of your medical condition, we're being renewed every day, day by day. So never give up. 2 Corinthians chapter 4, verse 16 in the New Living Translation. That is why we never give up. Though our bodies are dying, our spirits are being renewed each day. Number four, when it appears that the deck is stacked against you and nothing is going your way, never give up. Once again, 1 Corinthians chapter 1, verse 7 in the Message Bible. God Himself is right alongside you to keep you steady and to keep you on track until things are wrapped up. So never give up. Never forget that. And number five, prayer is absolutely the best thing to keep you on track. Luke chapter 18, verse 1. One day Jesus told His disciples the story to show that they should always pray and never give up. So child of God, here's what you need to know. You should never give up on yourself because God is not giving up on you. And that's what I call getting to the point.